Well, I... I wish there could be an invention that bottled up the memory like perfume and it never faded, never got stale. Then whenever I wanted to, I could uncork the bottle and, and live the memory all over again. And what particular moment in your young life would you want to keep? Oh, all of them. All these last few days. I, I feel as though I'd... I'd collected a whole shelf full of bottles. Sometimes, you know, those little bottles contain demons that have a way of popping out at you, just as you're trying most desperately to forget. Stop biting your nails. Oh, I wish I were a woman of 36, dressed in black satin with a string of pearls. <laughs> you wouldn't be here with me if you were. Would you please tell me, Mr. Dewinter, why you asked me to come out with you? Well, it's obvious that you want to be kind, but why do you choose me for your charity? I asked you to come out with me because I wanted your company. You've blotted out the past for me more than all the bright lights of Monte Carlo. But if you think I just asked you out of kindness or charity, you can leave the car now and find your own way home. Go on, open the door and get out. Blow your nose. <laughs> Please don't call me Mr. De Winter. I have a very impressive array of first names. George Fortescue Maximilian. But you needn't bother with them all at once. My family call me Maxim. And another thing. Please promise me never to wear black satin or pearls. Or to be 36 years old. Yes, Maxim. <laughs> <laughs> 